All right, guys. Um, I got my uh, ZBS driver complete now. Um, uh, what it is is uh, really simple. Actually, it's just your basic ZBS driver. Um, you've got your two MOSFETs here, your uh, resistors and your Zener diodes, your fast, rec uh, your fast recovery diodes there, your um, 470 ohm resistors here, uh, the inductor, the capacitor. Um, then your transformer here, which is uh, just uh, 12 turns. Uh, center tapped, and then we got uh, 260 turns of uh, 26 gauge wire here. Um, basically, that's about it. Um, right now, it's connected up to um, a little rectifier I made, um, which is just four 1N4937 diodes um, in a bridge configuration. Um, and uh, basically, then it's just hooked up to this capacitor here, which is a 450 volt, 350 microfarad capacitor. Um, and if we do just a little bit of math here real quick, um, we, uh, go to the calculator, um, we do, uh, 450 volts squared, that's 202,500, we, uh, times that by 0 .000, uh, 35 for 350 microfarads, and then we, uh, divide that by 2, and we get, uh, 35 joules. 35 and a half joules. Um, so, 35 and a half joules. Um, I'm not exactly sure. I haven't figured out how I'm going to exactly test this yet. Um, but I, I'm thinking if I just kind of put this like right here. Um, I can basically show you how fast this charges up. Um, there's going to be a little bit of a charge on the capacitor probably. Um, not too much though. Um, cause I did test this before this video, so uh, what we're gonna do is, whoops, just simply place it like so. Um, and uh, three, two, one, go. So as you can see, it charged up very quickly. Uh, it's at 470 volts there. Um, <laughs> so it'll go up to 473 volts. Um, but uh, so yeah, um, it's very fast. Uh, this charging circuit has just completely blown my mind. Um, now I've noticed that it jumps from around 8 amps, uh, pulling around 8 amps in the very beginning of the charge uh, when it drops down um, then it'll drop down to around uh, one amp or so uh, to continue the charging process um, I had that uh, hooked up through my battery charger um, just hooked it up uh, with the, the negative lead on the uh, positive end of the uh, just like this here I'll show you had it hooked up like this the negative end negative lead right there and then when we go through and we touch that to like and we do this it uh, it'll charge up and you can see the current draw on the meter um, now I have an older one so I don't know if it works for the new ones or not like that but I have an older one so it works like that and I can watch current draw um, so but anyways uh, I just wanted to just kind of show you that um, that I do have my ZBS driver working now so